integer overflow. An integer variable has a minimum and maximum value that it can support and cannot support a number outside of that range. Integer overflow occurs when the value being assigned to an int variable is greater than the maximum value that the variable is able to store. Integer overflow is a common issue when doing arithmetic. So let's take a look at an example of what happens when you do an integer overflow in Java. Let's create an integer called a and assign it to a really big number. It's 2 billion. And if, if you remember that the maximum value of an integer is a little bit over 2 billion. And you have another integer called b and assign that also to 2 billion. And let's say int c is a plus b and let's print out the value of c. And we get negative this giant number right here, which is not right. That's not the actual a plus b. It doesn't make any sense. We're getting an integer overflow error. To find out what the value, the maximum value of int a is, you could also do things like this. You can type integer with a capital I and the whole word spelled out dot max value. And you could print out the value of a. And you could see that the maximum value of an integer is this giant number. So if you were to add up two numbers that were that would eventually make the sum greater than this number, you get the integer overflow error. So to be safe, if you're dealing with really large integers, don't use int, use long instead. Now when you try to add up 2 billion plus 2 billion, you get 4 billion and now it works correctly.